African-American sailor who claimed his bunk had been vandalized with racial slurs by a shipmate faked the whole thing. The U.S. Navy says an African-American sailor who claimed that a fellow shipmate had vandalized his bunk with racial slurs actually faked the whole incident. Mark Wee Little, 27, an African-American aviation bosun's made airman aboard the aircraft carrier George H.W. Bush claimed in a Facebook post that one of his shipmates had vandalized his sleeping area with the word NN trashing it. In the November 15 post, which was apparently written under an alias Facebook account and has since been shared 20,500 times, Little had written, I proudly serve the Navy and this is what I'm receiving in return, the NavyTimes.com reported. Shortly after the post, Little told Navy Times that he worried about the vandalism and seeing the vandal out and about in town. I constantly have to look who's giving me the side eye, Little said at the time. On Friday, however, Commander Dave Hecht, a spokesman for Naval Air Force Atlantic, said that the Naval Criminal Investigative Service, NSIS, investigated the claims of racially motivated vandalism and discovered inconsistencies in Little's account of what happened, determining that he staged the incident himself. Hecht declined to name the sailor who made the claims, because he had not been charged with a crime but noted that the sailor would continue to serve aboard the George H. W. Bush and had received appropriate administrative actions and additional counseling and training. The Navy Times said that Little, via text message on Friday, denied staging the vandalism and said that NSIS investigation was not properly done. Little added that he had nothing to gain from doing such an incident but I have everything to lose. Even though NSIS had proven Little's claims to be false. Hecht said that the Navy was using the incident as the basis for giving the crew additional training and emphasizing that the Navy does not tolerate vandalism or racism of any kind. The well-being of our sailors is our top priority, Hecht noted, adding that the Navy has an open-door policy for reporting incidents of misconduct.